If you're struggling to get speed upgrades in Madden 22 franchise, this video is for you. Today, we're going over the top offensive upgrades that you need to make to give you the best players on offense. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel if you're liking this content. If you watch the defensive version of this video, you know that we prioritize speed over everything else. That doesn't change for offense, but in some of the positions, we need to be really specific about what we're targeting. That being said, let's get into it. I use two tight ends in my scheme, so it's super important for me to get as many speed upgrades as possible. For speed upgrades, I go with vertical threat. Tight ends get insane numbers of attribute boosts during each upgrade. Make sure you pay attention to what upgrades you're actually getting. Some of these are crazy, like release, change of direction, speed, acceleration, and all of the different route running abilities. Running back is where this gets a little more niche. The best speed upgrades come from elusive back. However, depending on the different type of running back you're trying to build, if you have a superstar running back who can get abilities, you might need to do other upgrades in order to qualify for those abilities. For example, if you need to be an 85 overall to get armbar or truck, you need to keep upgrading power back to make that happen. And the same would go for backfield master and receiving back. I still choose elusive back for my running back upgrades because one, it gets me the best opportunities at getting speed and acceleration and change of direction upgrades, and two, gets me closer to the human joystick ability, which is the gold tier of abilities for franchise running backs in Madden 22. In this video, we're not really talking about fullbacks or offensive linemen. Those upgrades are incredibly ability specific, and we can make a separate video going over the best abilities. However, in Madden franchise, those positions don't really change a lot as much as you upgrade them. I would just always recommend going for offensive linemen and fullbacks with strength, run blocking, pass blocking. Look at those abilities. Wide receivers get much, much better and much, much faster using the deep threat archetype. Not really a game breaking update here, but it's certainly important to know if you're going for a route runner or slot or physical. I don't know why you would ever do that but make sure you're choosing deep threat for speed upgrades because speed kills at wide receiver. The last position we need to go over on offense is quarterback. This is probably the most niche and very interesting conversation of all of the upgrades and abilities in Madden 22 franchise. Quarterbacks have four different archetypes you can upgrade. Field general, strong arm, improviser, and scrambler. We're not even gonna worry about field general and strong arm, they don't matter. Improviser and Scrambler both let you get speed and throw power upgrades, which are the most important attributes for quarterbacks in Madden 22. There's one big difference between the two that is a game changer for superstar X-Factor quarterbacks. By upgrading Scrambler, you might get throw power, but you have a high chance of getting speed. So if you want to go there with a non-superstar or superstar X-Factor quarterback, that's fine. However, if you have the opportunity to upgrade your quarterback to get Escape Artist, you should absolutely be going into Improviser because that's the archetype that actually controls whether or not you can get it. There are a few quarterbacks that come with Escape Artist base in the game. Those quarterbacks are Kyler Murray, Josh Allen, and of course, Lamar Jackson. If you don't have one of those quarterbacks, getting Escape Artist by upgrading Improviser is the only way to get a guy who can do what they can do. So if you think you're getting one of those guys, make sure you're upgrading Improviser. Otherwise, you can do Scrambler or Improviser interchangeably. I hope this video helps. Make sure to subscribe, like, do all the things, and we'll see you in the next one.